Another day of frustration with the water. So it keeps coming in on the left and I decided tonight to finally tear down past one more layer past the uh, dispersion screen. I'm going to pull that one out and see maybe there's something clogged. I don't know. Um, but the shots are still coming out okay, you know, but the, the problem is in the, the stream where it's really blonde, it's really over extracted and, and the rest is under extracted. So it's just an uneven extraction going on. Um, and I, so I, I reverted to an older profile that uh, wasn't getting as good of extraction, but was not prone to this air as quickly as the current profile I'm on. So this one, the water came in a little slower and it was able to slow down a bit, uh, but it's still coming through on the left faster. And this kind of picks up speed as the shot progresses. Um, and then I, I took this shot on the road and put it in a fellow little mug with some ice, made a very nice iced espresso. Um, but I, I can't get this pause for my other profile without it channeling too much. And part of me thinks that you slow down for the pause and the pause itself can cause channeling if water is flowing on, in unevenly, like if it's slightly uneven, makes it worse. Um, I also took my, um, my dried beans out of my oven and they left a little stain on the, the pans. I thought it was cute, but I, I have some uh, sourdough processed coffee now. And this beauty of a shot is produced by a Matzer flat burr that I couldn't get to grind finer, but it was the one I, I, I've been using from one of the offices at work. So I take another look and I might have to just switch to my manual grinder while I'm at work. When I got home, I had to look for my previous shot and you could see this big splotch from the top on the left where the shower screen was. So it's just another indication that uh, this is definitely a water problem. I didn't pull any staccato shots today because I thought it'd be a waste considering I'm having this major channeling issue. Uh, but I did take the coffee that was ground too coarsely on the previous grinder. I reground it using the niche and uh, it pulled a decent shot. But um, again, you just still have this problem from the left side. So here it pulls out really, gets really nicely dark color, has a nice pause. But then as more water comes in, it just keeps going to the left. So the other profile, it just came out sooner. Um, this one has a, a little, little bit of a slowdown, which uh, is, is better to manage this issue. Part of me miss, misses using a lever machine because with the lever machine, you just have this such control over what, uh, how you adjust. And I. I, I've been a little nervous about doing that on the, the descent, even though you can control each stage manually. So I took off the dispersion screen. I did another slow-mo video. So the um, left side of the, the where I always have the problem is at the top here. The two holes right by the screw on the top and then to the left, the two screw, two holes by the screw Though that's the left side, that's, that's water's coming through bad. So I'm gonna take this whole piece off tonight and take a look underneath and see if there's a problem and, and try to do a cleaning on this as well. I, I don't know if maybe there's a buildup that's causing this unevenness, but whatever the case is, I need to get down to the root of the problem.